Your teacher today is Dr. Bosa Science. Dr. Bosa is a teacher at the Science Foundation College, the best school that teaches sciences. Today, 1st April 2021, we are going to study Refraction of Light at Olive. Our website is the digital teachers. .co.ug. Here find the notes, exams and marking guides in physics, chemistry, biology, math and primary science. Our YouTube channel is Digital Teachers Uganda. Here find videos of physics, chemistry, biology, math of primary and secondary sciences. The best secondary school in Uganda is the Science Foundation College. The best primary school in Uganda is the Rock of Ages Primary School. Refraction is the change in the direction of light rays as they pass from one medium to another of different optical density or it is the change in the velocity of light when it moves from one medium to another of different optical density. Laws of refraction consider an incidentally to an interface between air and glass bending towards normal in the glass forming an angle R. The air is less optically dense than the glass. This implies that when a ray is from the air, it bends towards the normal. That is, angle I is bigger than the angle R. The first law states that the incident ray, the refracted ray, and the normal at the point of incidence all lie in the same plane. The second law, also called Snell's law, states that the ratio of the sign of angle of incidence to the sign of angle of refraction is constant. The constant ratio is the refractive index, i.e. The refractive index of two media is equal to the sine i over sine r. The second law is also called Snell's law of refraction. Definition is the refractive index is the constant ratio of the sine of an angle of incidence to the sine of an angle of refraction for any two given media. Refractive index has no units. Absolute refractive index is the ratio of the sign of an angle of incidence in air or of vacuum to the sign of an angle of refraction in a media. When you are looking at absolute refractive index, one of the media is a vacuum or air and light must be passing from air to the media. Refractive index can also be defined as the velocity of light in the medium one to the velocity of light in the medium two. Absolute refractive index is equal to the velocity of light in the air or of vacuum to the velocity of light in a medium. Example one, catch the angle R in the figure below. Refractive index of glass is equal to 1.5. From scenario zero, refractive index is equal to sine I over sine R. Where I is equal to 90 minus 50, which is equal to 40 degrees 
n that have told us that is equal to 1.5 so we can see that 1.5 is equal to sine 40 over sine r sine r is equal to sine 40 over 1.5 this is equal to 0 0.428 r is equal to sine inverse of 0 0.428 which is equal to 25 degrees experiment to determine refractive index of material of glass we are going to use a glass block place a glass block on a plain sheet of paper on a soft on a soft board trace the outline p q r s draw a normal at o draw a line AO making an angle I with the normal at O. Fix pin is P1 and P2 vertically along AO and replace a glass block on its outline. Fix pin is P3 and P4 to appear to be in line with images of pin 1 and pin 2 in the glass block. Remove the glass block, join the markings of P3 and P4 at B, then B at O, and measure angle R. Repeat the experiment for more five values of I and tabulate your results. So the table, table of results, Result is expected to have I in the degrees, then R in the degrees, then sign I has no units, then sign R have no units. Then when we plot, the values of sin i against the values of sin r, we get a straight line. Sin i over sin r, we get a straight line. The slope, slope is equal to n, where n the refractive index of grass. The factory index using Rio and apparent depth. An object placed below the grass block is seen as if it is raised at point I. The distance between the image and the surface of the grass block is the apparent depth. The distance between the object and the surface of the glass block or the thickness of the glass block is the real depth. The refractive index is given by real depth over apparent depth. Example 2. A pin placed at the bottom of the liquid of 8 cm deep appears to be at a depth of 6 cm when viewed from above. Find the refractive index of the liquid. In this experiment, real depth is equal to 80 cm. Then apparent, apparent depth is equal to 6 centimeters. We have already seen that the refractive index of a liquid is equal to 
layer depth of our parent depth which is equal to 8 over 6 which is equal to 1 point 1 point 3 3 Example fili, a glass block of thickness 50 centimeters is placed on a pin to an observer viewing from above the pin is raised by 1 centimeter. Find the refractive index of glass. We see that real depth real depth is equal to fili apparent depth is equal to 3 minus 1 because it is raised by 1 centimeter which is equal to 2 centimeters the refractive index is equal to layer depth over apparent depth which is equal to which is equal to 3 over 2 which is equal to 1 point 5 application is of real and apparent depth 1 a ruler appears bend when placed in a glass of water light rays from the bottom of the ruler are refracted away from the normal as they pass from water which is more optically denser than air and appear to be coming from B. Two, a swimming pool appears shallower. Light rays from the bottom of the swimming pool are refracted away from the normal and appear to be coming from I, the raised surface. Principle of reversibility of light states that the path of light through a given media is reversible. So light from air to glass follows the same path when reversed from glass to air. The refractive index can be given as from air to glass. The refractive index is equal to sine i over sine r. From glass to air, the refractive index is given by sine r over sine i. So the refractive index from air to glass is an inverse of refractive index from glass to air or n sin i is equal to a constant where n the refractive index and i is the angle of incidence thank you so much for listening to this video please find more videos on our website digitalteachers.co.ug or on YouTube channel Digital Teachers Uganda. Please subscribe to promote my videos. Subscription is free.